take off my money. What's up, family? Okay, so I went shopping. <laughs> and I normally don't go shopping for myself. Like, whenever I go into the store, I, I may intend to go in there and shop for myself. But somehow, some way, I always end up, like, swerve off into the kids section. And then when it comes to my kids, I'm just like, take off my money. But for myself, I'm, like, making life decisions. Like, do I really need that? I got something kind of like that already at home. I don't know what I'm going to wear that with. I don't need it. So, I finally did some online shopping for myself. Just for me. Just me. Nobody else. Because that's the other thing I'll do. I'll go in there, start shopping for myself, and then end up still buying stuff for the kids, too. Like, it, But I just went shopping for myself this time. So, um, I went to good old Shein because I finally like got my sizing right with them. So I kind of just stick to them since I got it right. Um, you know, if it's not broke, don't fix it. So picked up some stuff. I'm going to share it with you guys now. Um, Cause a lot of my clothes y'all I've been wearing since high school. Yeah. I mean, sometimes they fit, sometimes they don't fit. Like I go up and down in weight and so but I still keep it. <laughs> like, pants are too big. That's why God made belts. It doesn't fit the greatest, but I can still put them on with the help of a belt. So, yeah. <laughs> I went shopping for myself. Said so all that to say, I finally went shopping for myself. So, I'm just going to do a little try on for you guys. Let me move over to the side because I will be modeling everything over here just for you. Okay? Just for you. But all right, so we're going to get into the clothes first. I got a couple, one bathing suit and like two cover-ups, like swimwear type cover-ups. And then I got three um, sets, I guess that's what we can call them, sets. And I got myself a new pair of shorts, guys, and I'm so very excited. All right, and then two little accessory things. So let's start with the accessories first. All right, so the first one is this chain belt, which is so cute. Like, you guys see the little faux bling on it? On each of the circles, it has that. And then it has a third little circle on the tie. So I got this because I had bought this dress from H&M a while ago. Never wore it. And it's like one of those big like I don't know like oversized I don't know how to describe it here here are some pictures from Pinterest of how people have worn it styled it whatever so without the belt the dress is like huge on me and it's a medium and I was like okay it doesn't it gives me no shape whatsoever so let me just get this cute little chain belt so I can wear it with the dress and maybe it'll like cinch it a little bit and it won't look so cute because like the sleeves are like the big puffy ones <laughs> and like the dress is just so big so that was the reasoning behind me getting this chain belt but as you can see it, it didn't help too much like it didn't help too much at all I don't know what it is about the shirt if I should have like got a small instead of a medium but it's just so big like this the chain belt couldn't save it but it's still cute I can wear it with other stuff oh don't get it tangled now I can still wear it with other stuff nice pair of jeans another kind of dress of some sort but for the intended purposes the outfit that it was supposed to go with yeah it's a no it's, it's a no for me it, it just, it's not then the other accessory that I got was these anklets just five gold anklets and I thought they were really cute now on the picture on Shein's website the per the model was wearing all five of them and so at first I was thinking like oh that's really cute like it's all I thought it was like all attached 
like all it was really one anklet which just had like five bands on it no it's five separate anklets and they just had her put them all on and then strategically hold her ankle where they were all spaced out but they're still cute you can't go wrong with an anklet and at least if one breaks i have four more so these are cute for summertime i'm actually going to put one on today so yay all right now moving right along into the clothes here are my new pair of shorts they're cute um they have like that, I don't know what you call this ruching, that whatever at the top. <laughs> like they're really cute, lots of stretch. Um, and when I tried them on, like they don't ride up in the crotch area. Like you know how sometimes you gotta keep pulling your pants down when you got thick thighs and whatnot because your thighs just eat up the pants. I didn't really have that problem with these. They pretty much stayed put, which I appreciate so much. But I think they're so cute. I saw a pair of these in uh, Ross the other day, but they wanted $16 for these bad boys and she and didn't want that price at all. I believe these were like $10. So yay, I got my shorts. Next is this brown short set. And when I first pulled this out of the bag, I was like, I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. I don't even think I'm going to be able to do it. Because it looks so small. Like, especially the pants. Like, the ruching and stuff on the sides and the ties and whatnot. I was like, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know. I got a lot going on in the back. And then these thighs have ended many a pair of jeans so I don't know if these little pants was gonna be able to take it but they are so stretchy like fit in no problem everything fit the only thing that I didn't like about it was like because they do the the scrunching in the front like all the little ripples I don't like where they hit me like on my belly area like it wasn't my favorite but it's still cute especially with the sneakers that I had on in the uh when I showed you guys the anklets it's a fit y'all like it's a whole outfit so that was the top the bottoms and then here is the top again and I would have to figure out like what my bra situation would be in this shirt because it was still like showing on the side even when I tried to like pull the shirt up it was still showing so I don't know what I would wear bra wise with this but it's cute like <laughs> I, I actually really like it so that is this outfit and everything is in a size extra large I didn't know I don't think I said that in the beginning but everything is an extra large or a large which in she in terms I think an extra large is a 12 which is what size I wear in pants and a large I believe is like a 10 yes a large is a 10 now we're getting into this two piece set which again is just a pair of shorts and a shirt a crop top shirt so here are the shorts I'll show you the front just like some basic mom shorts kind of what they reminded me of some regular basic shorts but then it comes with This cute little hooded, sleeveless, crop top shirt, which I also thought was super cute. Like, she's a runner, she's a track star. Like, <laughs> what it reminded me of. Like, with a cute pair of sneakers, like you trying to go run some errands kind of thing. Like, just because you're only going to the supermarket doesn't mean you can't feel yourself and look cute while you do so. So, this was really cute loved this now getting into my last set which is this floral i don't know what you would call it but it's a short set so here are the shorts with the flowers um elastic here it's all good stretchy fit 
it did kind of like like bunch in the front which i wasn't a fan of like there was some bunching it wasn't my favorite not gonna lie um and it looks black like on camera right now it looks black but it is actually navy blue but it's cute like the bottoms are nice and airy like perfect for summertime when it's super hot out or if you're like on vacation on a beach on a boat like this is cute. nice and airy and then here is the top which I don't know to display this but you guys are gonna have to hold it up like so but yeah I don't know this was not made for women of a certain bra size this top because listen I am a 36 triple D up here and they wasn't this was no type of support like these girls need support okay they need just a little bit of lift and somebody who can hold on they just they just need something that can hold them but this was not it <laughs> like it was not it at all so I did have my bra on with these but in order to wear this shirt I feel like I would have to wear it without a bra so it I may need to invest in the brassy bra because the back of the shirt is really small like that's all you get for coverage so I tried to like use this to cover my bra which it did I'm not gonna lie it did cover my bra but then it would make the front like scrunch up and it had to go higher so then it just looked weird because it was just like space I don't know y'all see it over here it was so I would have to go braless to wear this but it, I just would need to find the right bra that would support the girls how they need to be supported because this is just like fabric like that is it, it it's just, just fabric there's no type of support but it's cute though it's cute though I like it like boat life this would be really cute okay guys so now we are going to get into swimwear um so this is the bathing suit that I got So this is the bathing suit that I got. Here is the top. And here I am modeling it. <laughs> and here are the bottoms. And it's really cute. Just purple, the snake skin print. Love it. Beautiful. Um, again, the girls, it was a little bit much for the top. The tie in the middle here, that does come off. Like it is detachable. So I guess. I don't know why you would want to detach it because it looks cute scrunched up like that but I don't know maybe if I tried it without the tie on it it would maybe cover a little bit more I don't know if I would wear this like taking my kids to the beach because that's where I plan to be this summer on somebody's beach somewhere I don't know if I would wear this like on a beach day with my kids just because of all the the boobage that was out up top but it's cute like it's cute <laughs> Like maybe out by myself, like a girl's day, just something like that. It's cute, fine, perfect. But out with my kids, it was just too much cleavage for me. Um, and then I tried it on with these crochet um, cover-ups, these pants, which I thought were really cute, super cute. However, they put elastic in it, so it is stretchy up at the top however the seam here like the seam up at the top is not stretchy and it gives you it does not forgive like it kind of hurt to pull it up and take it off because you have to like put your finger like right at the seam and then it was just it was, but it's stretchy just not at the seam it does not give you an inch an ounce or nothing but it's cute. It also does not come all the way down to my ankles. Kind of stopped a little bit before that, like a little high water-ish. But for picture's sake, it could be really cute. Like you walking down the beach, the tide is coming in, you got your feet all wet and whatnot. Like for that, it would look really cute. But it was okay. 
Like, if you're willing to struggle to get it on, which is what I don't want to do, it's like me trying to take this off, getting in the water, and I'm struggling because the darn seam <laughs> does not give me any stretch. Like, I got it. I got thighs and a butt that I need to get out of these pants, and it was not easy. Okay, and so for the last two things, is this bathing suit. Um, I don't know where I thought I was going or who I thought I was, but I am not about this life right here. Like the design is cute, the pattern is cute. Love it. In a perfect world, I would rock the hell out of this bathing suit. Every time I went to the beach, you wouldn't be able to pry it off me. But listen, <laughs> like I'm showing it to you guys now, but I can't turn around. Like the side view is about as much as y'all gonna get because I can't not turn around. My entire butt is out, y'all. Like this is kind of, it's one of those bathing suits that like just covers your crack, like just covers it. I don't know where I was going, what I was thinking. Like, it was cute. I thought maybe they had potential. And it does have potential for somebody who is about that life, but I am not. I am not. And then for the top, like, you would have to tie these little strings that it comes with for the straps super, super tight. Like, you know how much that would hurt, like, on your neck? How tight you have to tie this? Because, again... The support was non-existent and these girls right here like they have a story to tell okay they have a story to tell breastfed two kids okay fed two kids all the pulling the biting all of that they need support and this has none which is why you would have to tie it super duper tight to even try to give yourself some type of lift like some type like just, it was none it was just none so it was cute in theory it was real cute but then I paired it with these black uh pool cover-ups which are so cute love these we'll definitely be wearing these with another bathing suit not that one but not that one like together it looked cute together but that's as far as it's gonna go for a picture like go ahead and take the picture cheese but that's it <laughs> as far as it's going but these are cute i will be wearing these with something else like they're nice and soft i like the little fringy things on the side like these bottoms are really cute but for something else because this is a no this one was a no was a big fat no hey family all right so i know y'all are like what happened to your outfit? Why are your clothes different? Well, I wanted to just combine these two videos. So the first portion you guys saw were things that I picked up from Shein or Sheen or whatever they want to call themselves today. Um, those clothes are from there. But I wanted to wait until I got my shipment in because I picked up a few pieces from Lovely Wholesale and they finally, finally, finally came. So... I was just like, you know what, I'm not even going to dedicate a whole video to the lovely wholesale clothes because I didn't get that many pieces. So I might as well just wait, combine them both together. But I still got that same hair, y'all, like, and the same glasses. So, semi-continuous, like, <laughs> it's semi the same, okay? So I tried, all right? I, I tried only for y'all, only for y'all. Um, so I'm just going to jump right on into it and we're going to talk about this first two piece set that I got from Lovely Wholesale. Now I saw another YouTuber get this outfit and I was like, oh, that is really, really, really cute. Love it. But she, she got it in black and white and I got like this, I don't even know how you would describe this color, but I love this color. Whatever it is, I love it. It is my favorite. Um, but it's like just a regular 
I don't know what fabric this is. I'm not a good like person to talk about fabrics with. All I know that is clothes and it's stretchy. <laughs> and it kind of looks like it would be cool to wear like, you know, summertime when it get a little hot outside, you wouldn't die or suffocate in this. Like it's gonna let the breeze through. So the fabric, fabric, the fabric is breathable. And it only came with like this little itty bitty tag. Y'all even see it, can you see it? That's the tag. So it doesn't even like tell you what the material is. So I can't even try to fake a fraud and tell y'all what kind of fabric it is. But it's stretchy. I have a Champions two-piece outfit that is made out of the same material. If I wasn't lazy, I would go upstairs and get that outfit because it did actually come with a tag to tell you guys what material it is, but I'm not gonna do that. It's stretchy, like, it's very stretchy. As you can see, um, I love it. Did I say that I love it? Because I really love it. Uh, I think it's so cute. It is a bit long on me. I'm only 5'6", so tall girls, this is for you because you got lots of extra stuff. Like, as you can see, over here, I was able to like put it over my whole foot, basically. I had so much extra fabric. So that's the only thing. Like if I had to be nitpicky and pick something I didn't like about it, it would be the fact that like I could fit my whole foot <laughs> into the extra fabric that was left behind. But whatever, it's still cute. It's real cute. All right, and then moving on to outfit number two that I got from Lovely Wholesale. It is this piece here which at first I was a little scared because I saw this on that same YouTuber's channel who had the last outfit that she didn't really like. So she had this one as well. And I was like, oh, this is really cute. I like the pattern. And it's that same stretchy um, spandex type of material. Like it does do a lot of stretching. You got some stretch, there's some give. So, the only thing is this is the top, guys. The opening that you see on me that's in the that I have in the back, it is actually supposed to go in the front. I tried it on in the front. However, I already told y'all about my girls and the attention that they require. And when I put this shirt on, the girls was all out. Like it wasn't even nothing could be saved. I was just gonna be showing them off for the world. Like y'all would have saw my areola and everything. So I had a friend in college who was like really into fashion and she wanted to be a fashion designer. And so she taught me that nothing is garbage. Like you don't, you, you can work with anything, basically. Anything can be worked with. So I was like, okay, in this situation, what would Sadie's do? And her voice popped into my head and she was like, girl, turn that thing thing backwards. So I did. So just turned it in the back. Girls are covered, fully covered, all covered. Everything is all good. And then I got a nice little cutout in the back and I would have to like invest in like brassy bra or something just because I wouldn't want my bra strap to be shown in the back. But that's an easy fix, like super, super easy fix. But all I did was turn this good old shirt around and the girls were contained because forward the way they intended it to be worn they was busting out the seams but backwards everything is all good and this is now one of my new favorite outfits all right and so the third outfit i got from lovely wholesale was this red queen dress um i thought it was really cute i have been seeing it a lot on like the you know how lovely wholesale does those little ads on the side of like facebook and instagram and such and i have been seeing it on there a whole lot um i definitely wanted the ones where I saw where they had like the actual like card face on it where I like had the picture of the queen on the dress I wanted that one but they didn't have that one or at least I didn't see it when I was searching on their website so I just ended up getting this one plus I think this one was on sale so you know if it's on sale it's for me okay me and sales are best friends so I got this one um it's just a basic cotton t-shirt dress it feels a little bit more t-shirt than dress. Like it is a little a little bit short. I would definitely want to wear some shorts underneath this just because I feel like if I bend over, I'm going to be showing everybody everything. And that's just, that's not me. Like for some girls, they cool with it. 
but that's not me. So I would definitely wear some shorts underneath this if I was just gonna wear the dress, the t-shirt as a dress. There we go, because it's more like just a really big shirt. Um, like there's no shape to it or anything. Like it's not even like tapered at the bottom. Like you know how most t-shirt dresses like come down to like a U kind of thing? This doesn't do that. It's just a really big t-shirt. <laughs> like if you had a boyfriend and your boyfriend wore a 5X shirt, this would be it. Like it's a full out t-shirt, but it's big enough to look like it's a dress. So definitely wear some shorts underneath this, or at least like like little spandex shorts, if not some jean shorts, some spandex shorts, most definitely. But I like it. Something cute to pop out in summertime with. Cute and quick. It's my favorite thing to wear. All right, and the last thing that I got from Lovely Wholesale was this t-shirt, which I am all for a t-shirt with a funny saying on it. So this one says, please don't try me, try Jesus. He's still working on me. And truer words have never been spoken, okay? Never have they ever. Um, Love the shirt, love the chick on the front. Um, love the colors. The only thing I wish is like the wording seems a little bit out of place for me. Like I wish it was rearranged to say, try Jesus. Please don't try me. He's not done working with me yet. Like if that, like the try Jesus part should have been up top and then please don't try me should have been second. And then the little phrase should have still said at the bottom. But that's just me being nitpicky. Again, I just wish the saying was rearranged. That's probably because I'm thinking of Tobe's song and he has it in that order. It just flows better to me. It, again, it may be because of the song that I'm thinking that it flows better, but just in looking at the shirt and reading it, it still seems to just flow better if they would have rearranged the wording. But it's cute. The shirt is comfortable. And again, it is stretchy. I love me some stretchy fabric because you can go up a few sizes if you need to, like fill it out a little bit more and it'll still be cute because it stretches. <laughs> um, and mom life, listen, a lot of times dinner is whatever is left on your kid's plate that they don't eat. And so not all the times do kids eat the healthiest things. At least I know my kids don't. Dinner for me has been chicken nuggets and french fries or pizza rolls that my kids didn't eat on their plate many a night. So. If I go up a few sizes or down a few sizes, this shirt will still fit me pretty cute. Okay guys, so that brings us to the end of my mommy shopping spree, online shopping spree, because I still don't do crowds and people like that to be out in crowds and whatnot. But yeah, please let me know which outfits were your favorite and have you gone shopping online lately? What did you pick up? Let me know. Uh, DM me some pictures I would love to see because I'm always for some shopping <laughs> yeah so please make sure you like comment share subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one